Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Ilona and I have some more happy mail. Okay, these are the tags and she sent some goodies and you don't have to do that. It's not necessary. Uh, thank you so much. I'm really happy with it, but uh, for the people outside of the Netherlands, please, you don't have to send me anything. It just uh, makes the cost uh, bigger and it's not what's it, what this is about. Thank you so much, Mildred, and I will use it. And I love these, uh, these glitter uh, frames. I've never seen them. It's beautiful. Wow, and these I have seen, it's from a local uh, sort of dollar store, love the camera. And for the tags I'm gonna zoom in, okay, let's start with these. And I also saw her video and I was in love with this teapot, I love the little um, tea baggie hanging uh, in the pot. Very pretty. And this is just what my challenge is about. A simple shaped tag decorated. Beautiful. Very nice. The cup, tea cup. And she used some corrugated board uh, underneath. Then some patterned paper. Some bling, some trim. Inspire, cute uh, embellishment and a little butterfly, also very beautiful. Simple and elegant, love it, beautiful. And this one is also super cute. She said it's uh, wood and then the corrugated uh, cardboard she put on and the uh, heart is on dimensionals and then some blink trim, some trim and butterfly again and the word love I just, it, it's it's simple but it's it's just gorgeous thank you so much this would go uh, well on on the front of a of a book, for instance, and then you decorate it. Yeah, I have, uh, that's going to be used. And then she made this tag, and I'm guessing this will be the mixed media one because I'm seeing some sort of stenciling, and the papers are really distressed. There's some doily peeking out here, which you cannot see that that good, and also there key and the lock and some beautiful roses and um, she, she stickled them but maybe she did something else to color them some sorts a resin one and a beautiful crocheted one underneath and I'm looking at it and I think it might be from Pat Ask and Crochet so fine Really, really gorgeous. So it could be one of Pet S's flowers, but I'm not sure. And this is really a beautiful mixed media tag. I, I love it. It's only too big to fit in my little box. But anyways, you will get your entry for this one as well. And um, yeah, oh, and I now see this paper. And this is one of my favorite papers of all time. It's from a local store here and uh, I had two packs and there only were two papers uh, in, in each pack so I had four papers and I, had, I used them on a box for my uh, birthday challenge three years ago so it's, it's that old at least if it's the same paper and it looks like it is and she has a message on the back 
Hoi Ilona. She likes the challenge. Uh, she says maybe it's a, a wrong tag, but she sends it anyway. And yes, it is not a tag that fits in my box, but I absolutely love it. So you will get your entry for this one. And it is mixed media, so she's, uh, she's in both uh, challenges. So Mildred, thank you so much for entering my challenge. I, uh, I really appreciate it. And if anyone sees this and thinks, oh, I want to uh, check out this uh, challenge, please do. I will put a link to my challenge in the description box and at the end of the video. So you can uh, click on the link and go directly to the video. And if you don't want to listen to me rambling, go to, uh, I think, about 10 minutes. And then I start to really explain. <laughs> Uh, what the challenge is about and the, the, the part before there is uh, a part of my story and how blessed I feel. And so uh, if you do not want to go through there, uh, just skip the first uh, seven, eight, nine minutes. And of course you can also read in the description box what the challenge is about, but listening to how I explain might make it a little bit uh, clearer. I also got some questions about the technique cards and I will make another video showing some examples. And I also uh, made a video of how I made them, but they will... I have to edit them and then upload them, so that will take a little while because this also came in between and I want to show this uh, as fast as I can, so this will go up first. So if you don't know uh, how to do technique cards, or what I mean by that, then uh, you can watch uh, one of my next videos. And this is just what I ex explained for, the, for the, the paper crafters, for the shaped tags. So it's not really that hard. So I hope uh, more people will enter. Thank you all for watching and have a wonderful day and please enter my challenge. Bye bye everybody! Thanks so much for watching my videos. If you like my videos please let me know by leaving me a comment. I'd love to hear what you think about my projects. Of course you can also hit the like button to let me know. If you want to see more please hit the link right there. It will take you to the video of the project that I made before this one. And you can also click on my YouTube name sign above here to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any more videos. See you with my next video. Bye bye and have a wonderful day.